there's a, two different kinds of cameras that we're dealing with today. One is a point and shoot and one is an SLR. The point and shoot um, are smaller, they have less functions, and the SLR is um, the single lens reflex means that the lens that you're looking through is the lens that you're shooting through. Um, whereas like your other cameras, you're looking up here but the lens is down here and it's, it's just a different, um, different camera, different, um, different options available. Who shoots on auto? Who has an expensive camera and shoots on auto? Okay, let today be your last day shooting on auto. All done. As a matter of fact, you can take a little black Sharpie and black out the little <laughs> happy face that means auto because you're not going to go back there again. We're going to be done with auto because you might as well have a point and shoot. You might as well have not bought your SLR if you're, if you're just shooting on auto. Um, you have no control of your flash. It decides for you if your camera flash. It doesn't give you very many menu options. Um, it doesn't let you control your ISO speed. Um, and it, do, do you guys know what ISO speed is? We're going to cover that just a little bit, but if you remember back to when we were all bu buying film, you've got 200 and 400 and 600 and 800, and that all refers to the light sensitivity of, uh, of your um, exposure, which just lets you, it just gives you more control over your um, lighting situation depending on where you're at. If you're indoors, low light, then you can adjust that. Those are things that auto does not let you do. Okay, the next thing that we're going to talk about is on your camera, it's A, and I know that on every camera it's different. Sometimes it's AV, mine is on the Nikon, it's an A, and that's aperture priority. Um, who knows what aperture priority means, or the aperture, just that mo whole mode. Has anybody used it before? We're going to talk about ap aperture in and of itself a little bit more, but we're going to talk about the mode and what it allows you to do. Um, if you want to shoot at a certain aperture, then you get to set it in aperture priority and the camera automatically chooses the shutter speed setting for you um, to achieve the exact um, exposure that's needed. When you change, every time you change the aperture, the camera automatically adjusts the shutter speed. Um, times that you might want to use this mode is when you are shooting, um, when you are shooting when depth of field is important. If you want your background to be really out of focus but your subject very in focus, then you're going to want to shoot with aperture priority. Um, if you're in low light, so if I'm shooting indoors and I don't want to use my flash, then I'll set my camera down to the lowest aperture, um, let's in more light, and that's a good time to use your aperture priority too when those things are important.